Y es miedo que le tienen a la grella. Yo sabía que iba a doblar desde que yo te vi. Tú te salvaste porque ese día no me dio para ti. What's going on? Welcome back to my channel. And if you're new, hey, what's up? My name is Maribel, and I'm a personal trainer. Today, we're doing like day. You heard me. You heard me. We're doing like day. We're going to be working our glutes, hamstrings, and our calves. Because who don't like big calves? Before we do that, don't forget to comment, share, and subscribe. Comment down below what's your favorite leg day workout. Let's get it. So your warm-up is just going to be warming up sets. If you feel like you need a longer warm-up, just warm up. Go to my TikTok, and I have a lot of warm-ups there. So I'm going to pick up the dumbbell. Make sure that you have the barbell on your upper back, not your neck. For your stand, I want it to be a little bit more narrow than usual. And then I want you to just squat. If you feel like your stand for narrowing is too narrow, just open it up. Because I just noticed I need a bigger stand. So shoulders width apart. Chest is open. I'm engaging my core. Heads up, you don't have to go as low as me. If you're not that flexible or if you're just not ready, that is totally fine. You are gonna do a warming up set. This is your first warming up set. Do two. Okay. Placing your barbell back. You always are looking where, what are you doing, you know? Okay, now. For after your warming up set, do four sets. And you want to progress your weight every set. Progressive overload. This is your week. Last week we did it. Today is your week. I only do progressive overload once, sometimes twice a week, but mostly once. So today's my day to go up. So after your warming up set, you're going to do your working set, as I mentioned, and you're going to do four sets. I don't want to give you a rep because I don't know how much you are lifting. If you, like me, I'm going to add, obviously, that's what I have available. I'm going to add the 25. I'll probably, with the lightweight, I'm going to do 15. Then I'm going to go down to 12. Then probably 8. And then probably, last week I did 4 reps. So I'm probably going to do either 5 or stick to 4. Remember to listen to your body. Use proper form and adjust the weight according to your fitness level. If you're new to the barbell or even the squat rack, I would consider talking to your personal trainer around your local gym. Squat racks are popular in home gyms and commercial fitness facilities because of their versatile and the ability to perform a wide range of compound exercises in a safe manner. If you still feel like you don't feel safe with the squat rack or with a barbell, feel free to use dumbbells. After your squats, you're going to go ahead and do your bridges. I want you to elevate that bridge. I want you to also add dumbbells. If you feel like I still need a more warming up, just do a warming up set and then get into your workout. Always do two warming up set until you actually start your working set. Do four sets of 12. And if you are adding a warm up set, add two warming up set and then do four workout sets. So now we're moving to our working set. Make sure that you're lifting your hips towards the ceiling, squeezing your glutes at the top. If you do want to get on a mat, that's totally fine. Just lay on your back and you should do the same exercise or the same movement. Okay, so now that we're done with your glutes, we're going to move on to your hamstrings. So we're going to start with deadlifts and then we're going to move on to donkey kicks. I'm going to do dumbbells and I'm going to start with 20. So each barbell is 20. If I feel like, hey, I want to do the barbell, then I'll go ahead and do the barbell. But for now, I'm going to stick with my 20. Maintain a flat back and engage your core during each lift. Now we're going to do donkey kicks. I want you to do three working sets. I want you on all fours, lift one leg, keeping the knee bent at a 90 degree angle. I want you to focus on your kinetic chain, which is your entire body. I want you to engage your core. After you're going to do your standing calf raises, I want you to do three working sets. I want you to raise onto your toes, lifting your heels off the ground. I am going to progress my calf raises and I'm going to use my barbell, so I'll go ahead and show you that. 
if you are in the gym just use the calf machine which is one of my favorite machines i really really love that machine i usually do it almost every other day it's one of my favorite machines to actually use don't forget i have a warm-up as well as a cool down if you are in need on my tiktok guys thank you for watching and i'll see you tomorrow if you don't come in your house like that, you're blessed to make it home? What are you doing?